What is good in the hood? We are rank five. We're trying to get more points. We're trying to climb more ranks. You know the drill. Let's get into the video. Uh, I'm just gonna bang out 25 mil mining while doing UFC, watching UFC. 250 points just like that. I didn't even realize that I haven't maxed out all my fragments, but I guess I have to be wearing them to actually level them up. And I just haven't been using some of these things since I just got maxed. We are getting 25 mil mining right now. We're about 1.7 mil XP away. But yeah, we just completed our Rumpel Bowstring, which was our last fragment. We've just been wearing them while we're doing mining. 250 league points. Putting me over 45,000 points now for 45,165. And that is 25 million mining XP. Just done this over here. We had the smithing thing on too, so we got to 18.5 mil smithing. We'll be quicker to just make random stuff, but I think I am going to make a decent amount of cannonballs just so I don't have to do it later. And then we can finish up 25 mil smithing too. 45,290 points now. I got like 12.5k cannonballs now, so I'm just going to start making normal stuff for faster XP to hit this 25 mil. If we honestly never make more cannonballs than that in the late later on, then we will. And that is 25 million smithing XP as well, putting me out to what? 45,415 points. Got my rank 5 back. Let's keep going. Oh, I just I just got the task for completing Theater of Blood 50 times, so it does stack with uh, hard mode. So there's a bunch of KC milestones for Theater of Blood and Theater of Blood hard modes, and I think they are joined together for the normal Theater of Blood ones, because as you can see here, I only have 41 normal Theater of Blood KC, but I completed the 50 times task. That's because I have 9 hard modes done, and we get another purple. And even after 50 Theater of Bloods, I've still only seen two purples in my name, two of Renic Defenders. Jinami gets a purple this time, and I'm raiding with Hootie, so we all know what's going to happen next. Last time you guys did that, I, I don't think Ditter's gotten any better. I just think the gear's oh, gotten better. Yeah, Jinami just hits harder now. Bro! Oh my left, god, this left. kid. See, and it's not an This kid is stealing all my <laughs> fucking Give me a purples. Sauce. No, uh, it's still an Avernic! <laughs> it's glitched, bro. It's actually glitched. So what do we just do? I got a Grandmaster task. Okay, that's good because I need to get like it all was, of them. Nobody, nobody took NATO damage while they were. And, and no nobody... purple. This is bullshit, dude. Changing Did I get back. you killed, Jinami? No, no, no. It's all me. Hundred percent. You didn't nail anything. <sighs> I fucking hate this game, bro. Oh my what? god, bro! I hate Rootscape. Oh. How do I die? Ow. How? 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 <laughs> how is this happening? How is this <laughs> happening? <laughs> we have five deaths in hard mode. I hate oh, you. Geez. That's full Justy, let's go! <laughs> and then we got a back-to-back -back purple, which was another face guard for Hootie. Okay, so right now I'm using the Hot on the Trail Relic, which basically means there's a 10% chance of getting a medium clue every single- Oh, or any clue, really, but because I'm doing Mahogany Logs, it's a medium clue. Uh, there's a 10% chance of getting a clue every time you light a fire. I've only got like 260 Mahoganies right now, so hopefully that should give me around 25 mediums to go do. Which will be very nice and we'll rack up some points, and if we can get a shot at Ranger Boots, that'd be huge for us. Okay, I've burned all of those, and I have 36, maybe 37 if I get lucky, medium clues to do. So we're just going to get done on the- 37, yes, we are a very lucky man. From 38, oh my god, go on son, 39? Nah, okay, we've got 38 medium clues to do. Dragon Impling. Oh, some Dragon Darts. Alright, I have 29 caskets, should probably stop at 30 because it's a clean number or whatever, but I'm bored, I want to go do tall, I want to take a shower, so we're going to do a little pack opening right now. All right, we're hoping for Ranger Boots. We're not opening these on Enchant or anything. By the way, I also saw a lot of you guys commenting on my last video. Hey, did a bitter. You can't, uh, you can't get blessings on Entrana. Yeah, Yes, you can. Shut the fuck up. I have watched multiple people do it. It's the best way to do it. That's how you get the blessings. But I want other stuff for medium clues. So yeah, 29 clues. Let's open them. Ranger Boots? No. Uh, okay, that's gained 25 unique items from medium clues. So that's 50 points right there. What's that? Green D head body. Hasidious banner. Nothing too special. Arceus banner. Nothing too special. Adamant plate skirt trimmed, white headband. I wish the pop-ups didn't come up like that. Oh, that's filled 20, 20 medium clue collection log slots as well. Okay, that's nice. Bando stole. Okay, that's good. That's actually really good. Let me get that in the bank. That's actually really good for my set effects. Um, let's actually bank a bunch of shit, I guess. Um, let's get the caskets back out. Ancient miter, damn. Uh, penguin mask. Come on, give me some ranger shoes for the one time. Ancient cloak. Zamrak Miter? Okay, that's good. I think that is good. Actually, I'll probably be using a Slayer Helm most of the time with something like that, but still. Caskets. Uh, Gothics and a Zamorak Cloak and a Black Leprechaun Hat, which is cool, I guess. Green Dehyde Chaps. Mithril Full Helm Gold. Come on, give me some Ranger Shoes, bro. Gothics Page. I need to save some of those. That is filled 40 medium col clue collection log slots, which is 125 league points. Awesome. We just jumped up to 45,640. Very, very nice. Ancient Stole. Nothing too crazy. Bando's Crozier. I mean, I guess I have to wear that, so that's not actually that great at all. But, yeah. Let's open these last two. Any Ranger Shoes? 
Unfortunately, no ranger shoes. Another band is crazier as well. Damn it, bro. No, uh, ranger shoes. My luck would turn around. I swapped out the fragments of Hootie Tootie and Jinami, the bad luck fragments, in hope that I would get some better luck with Eevee Scape and McNeil. And this is how it went. Oh, I hate you, McNeil. Bro, what the hell? I despise you as a human. Oh my god, I could use that too. What a fucking cock. Yes. McNeil just died. Oh, new PB. What the hell? We're too quick. Legit. Mine's like 11.47. Oh my god, bro. How is that not mine? Three nails? It is, bro. What the fuck? He's gonna get a scythe. Ended the top sessions with about 46 normal KC and 14 hard mode KC. The purples on average are 1 in 9 per person, like to get it in your name. And I still have two Infernic Defenders to my name. Awesome. For those of you who don't know, Jax actually decided to extend this league by two weeks when we were already over two weeks into it. It's a money grab and they hope that the activity is going to last all the way to the end. But a big complaint of the last league is that it was too long and that it was dead towards the end, apart from the long-term competitors like myself. I think the decision was made prematurely, there was still a month to go, and I think by the time the league would have ended, the activity is going to be super low anyway, and it's only going to be some of the top page competitors and a couple others really playing. I think they could have waited before they made the decision, or maybe not made it at all. Their planning has always been sort of whack. As you guys know, this was meant to be released in November or something, but they delayed it for the release of Group Iron Man, and how many people are you watching are still playing Group Iron Man? Now, I was already committed for the six week grind, 24 seven grind for you guys. And despite this really throwing a wrench in my plans, as well as my health to an extent, I'm not just gonna up and quit. I'm gonna power out this final two weeks because I really do believe I can end in a great position on this leaderboards. And I, I really just do love competition. All I can ask from you guys is to keep showing the support you guys have been showing me for the past two weeks. We've, plun we've flown past 100K subscribers and there's still a solid 30,000 of you guys who aren't yet subbed watching this video right now. So if you could click that button, help me out. We've got over five more weeks of this. You're gonna be seeing a lot of me. Might as well be subbed. I planned to this earlier and completely forgot that it was a task. What do you mean I don't have inventory space for it? I literally have personal banker on. Uh, harvest a Snapdragon and Weiss, Weiss, Woos. It's a 45,000, no it's not. It's a 50 point task putting me at 45,815. Um, I'm just doing some herb runs because I wanna work on 25 mil farming and I've been very, very lazy with it as well as 25 mil herb lore. Um, just finished this run up now. I think I might go work on some diaries because I still haven't done everyone. Can't really do diaries because I am missing some stuff here or there. I've got a bunch of herbs, so I'm just going to make these all into potions. I am only at 13 mil herb lore, so 12 mil XP is going to be a big ass, but let's see if we can do it. Okay, we cleaned all the herbs and we actually went up a whole 1 mil XP, which is a good sign. All right, let's get potion making. Okay, I'm at 21.7 mil XP. I'm about uh, 3 point something mil XP off of it. All right, I've got like 470 toy still potions just from herb runs. I'm at 23.5 mil herb lore XP, so I'm just going to sand few glitch to 25 mil. And that is 25 million herb lore XP. Shout out to Samfuse. I am more than prepared for Nightmare now. 25 million herb lore XP. 45,940 points creeping up on that 46k. Alright, let's alk some shit. I'm literally maxed and I've only just dismantled 20 filled birdhouses. That's why I came here. I'll probably do some herbie while I'm alking for this demonic throne as well. See what happens. But yeah, I'm just trying to get to 25 mil cash now so that I can build the demonic throne because that's a master uh, task which is worth 250 points. And that's 25 mil. Let's go buy the stuff to make a demonic throne and we're going to splash the cash, but it's 250 points that I really want. We got like 1 mil cash left. Awesome. And that is a demonic throne which is 250 league points. You know, a throne for the king, for a little king DB. 46,215 points and got that gives us back our rank 5. All right, we are done with Void. I just decided to come here because I'm tired and it's pretty AFK and there's nothing really else to do. It only really takes an hour with the Relic, so it was pretty chill. Um, I'm super tired and it's very low effort from the brain. So super easy for me to do. Let's get a Void set. This basically unlocks like hundreds and hundreds of points for us because we need the Western Provinces Diary as well. So let's do it. Um, I guess I'll get the Ranger Helm. It doesn't really matter. It's not really best in slot on this league like it was the last, but wear a full Void set for 50 league points damn that does not seem worth the time at all but it unlocks a bunch of other points so it is what it is 80 46,265 not 86,000 i was getting some more pieces for skatizo while watching some people do solo hard mode theater of blood because i may or may not want to attempt it one day because i'm really going dry on drops and i want to get it and we managed to pick ourselves up an imbued heart haven't got one of these yet very big for us and it is 125 league points and activate activate an imbued heart 46,390 points now. Let's go do some of the tasks. Planted my crystal acorn last night. I really hate how farming actually takes the normal time, bro. Why can't I just take like 20 minutes? 
Finally got around to it. We do need crystal shards anyway, and checking a uh, checking a growing crystal tree is 50 points right there. So 46,440 points. Just going to chop it down now too, and hopefully get some crystal shards out of it. 42, we take those. I literally have enough tackle to buy a full obby set from just all my jazz. I thought I was going to have to sell an onyx, but wear a full obsidian set. 50 league points, still hadn't done that because it just wasn't worth it early. 3 mil for 50 points wasn't worth it early, but now I literally just got it for my taco, which is nice. 46,490 points. Holy shit, that was quick as fuck. Oh, it's probably from the quest I did earlier, the Lament quest or whatever, where I had to go make a statue or some shit. <laughs> Mine 30 chunks of granite, 25 league points, 46,550 now. Okay, I need to unlock broader fletching, which is 300 points. Now let's buy something. Buy some unfinished broad bolts and finish them and that is fletch some broad arrows or bolts 25 league points 46,540 it's time for some more scatizo and i also have some chins on me because i want to get two of the combat achievements out the way should be done there yep nice elite combat task up for the challenge very very nice okay apparently i didn't do that right it needs to be with an actual like explosion explosion well that's so frustrating bro i'll just do it later and that is 50 scatizo kills another 125 league points 46665 that is a confusing number to say out loud but I do have enough totems to get to 60 kills, which is another elite task, so let's go, go do that as well. That is 60 Skatizo kills, 46,790 points. Don't got really any more points to get from this anymore, but there's still a bunch more later, so as the league goes on, we'll be farming it some more. Nice, let's see if we can push towards 47,000 points now. Okay, there's a task to do 500 demonic gorillas, and I think I'm around 380 kills, maybe close to 400, so honestly, it shouldn't take me too long to finish up 500 on task. And, uh, you know, it's just another quick and easy 125 points, so let's go do that real quick. Alright, and that is 500 Demonic Gorillas completed, 40, 46,915 points, very, very nice. Don't have to go back there for a while. There is a 750 task, but I don't know for sure that I'm going to do it. Alright, and that's 23.6 mil farming XP from just a bunch of farm runs and shit and a bunch of herb runs. Just going to go finish it off at Tithe Farm because I still need to get a reward from there, and it's only 1.4 mil XP, so that's like three games, if that. Okay, and this right here is going to be 25 mil farming. We're not going to stay at the Tithe Farm just for now. We can come back later to get the task done. Obtain 25 million farming XP, 125 points earned, 47,040. Okay, I'm going to go do a Sire kill real quickly. And honestly, I might camp it out. I got 200 Abyssal Demons when I assigned myself the task. An Abbey Dagger is a 125 point task. A Bludgeon is a 125 point task. Offering an Unsired is a 125 point task. And just killing it is 50 points. So it is actually really good. I did it on the Trailblazer League. And just with the relics I had and stuff, it was really, really hard to do. But uh, with this, access to the whole game, some really nice maxed out gear, should honestly be pretty okay, so let's do it. Oh, I haven't even unlocked it yet. I still have over 1,100 Renown. Damn, I'm really washed up with this boss, huh? Okay, let's do this. Okay, and that is Sire completed for the first time. I am a little bit washed up at it, but it is 50 points right there, giving me 47,090 points. Probably will count this out eventually, I don't know if I'm going to do it right now or if I'm going to go do some clues first. But getting that one kill, that 50 points, puts me back at rank 5 with 47,090 points. Shout out to all my bros and hoes and those who picked their nose who made it to the end of this video. We are once again ending in rank 5 with 47,000 in terms of points. The grind can't stop, won't stop, and I'm going to be working on some things in the next video to hopefully climb up the ranks again and start distancing myself from the people below me. Guys, please let me know what you guys think about the two-week extension in the comments. Are you guys going to be playing personally? Do you think it shouldn't have been done mid-league? I want to know. I want to get some other perspectives because, you know, I'm prob I'll probably a little bit selfish with my own. Uh, drop a like and please subscribe if you're new. It really helps get my channel out there in this little crazy al algorithm we've got going on. And I'm forever grateful for you guys. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time.